Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector. And no, this is not a review. I just wanted to do an update in my Transformers Generation 1 collection and Generation 2 collection as of 2023. And how many bots do I own as of this year? You're about to find out. This is my entire Generation 1 shelf. And I got quite a few bots here. I'm still missing quite a few in my collection. I want to get a bigger ratchet. I want to get gears and a G1 vehicle mode Ironhide here. Here we got my random Transformer shelf. We got my Infernicus combiner here. Down there we got... Superion, we got Jetfire, we got the Dinobots, Swoop, Snarl, Slag, Grimlock, Warpath, Powerglide, Cosmos, Sea Spray, and we got uh, Red Alert, Hoist, and who could forget Tracks. And up here on the Generation 1, we got Jetfire, Optimus, Skids. Brawn, Wind Charger, Bumblebee, Cliff Jumper, Huffer, Trailbreaker, Mirage, Sideswipe, Sunstreaker, Wheeljack, Hound, Prowl, and Jazz. So that's my entire Generation 1 and Generation 2 Autobot collections. Oh, we got Perceptor here in Transformers Generation 1. So we got Perceptor too. Always forget to mention him. Down here, we got my Transformers Generation 2 collection. Just going to flick on the lights to get some more light in here. We got Combiner Wars, Bruticus, Combiner Wars, Devastator. Those are the main Decepticon combiners. I do got Menasaur, but I'm going to probably think about getting the Legacy Menasaur to add to this shell. We got the Generation 2 Decepticons, Kickback, Shrapnel, Bombshell. Blitzwing, Ramjet Thrust and Dirge, Astro Train, A Little Menasaur, Megatron, Soundwave, Rumble, Frenzy, Laserbeak, Buzzsaw, and Rabbit. Those are customs from the Bethel Park Soundwave I did. I like doing custom figures. They're a lot of fun to do. Down here we got Megatron, Star Th Scream, Thundercracker, Skywarp in there. Cybertronian Jet Modes, I got Netflix Soundwave, Kickback, Bombshell from Generation 1, we got Soundwave's Minions, Rumble Frenzy, Laserbeak Buzzsaw, and Ravage, why not? And then we got the Generation 1 Jet Mode, Decepticon, Starscream, Thundercracker, Skywarp, Reflector, we got View Blast, Viewfinder, Viewglass, and Viewfinder, Spyglass. The main three bots that form Reflector here. And we got Reflector himself, so yeah. And we got Shockwave down there, the good old Creo Transformer and Transforming Shockwave. I forget the line he comes from, but this is the most epic Transformers Generation 1 collection you ever did see. I am going to think about getting the ARC ship to go right up there for Transformers Generation 1. So we'll have the ARC and the Nemesis. Maybe after I save in August and July, I will get the ARC. And then for Christmas... I am going to pick up the Nemesis Starship to go right up there on the shelf next to Bruticus. And that'll be my biggest two ships. And I'll have my Titan collection almost complete, except I need Omega Supreme. And then I'm done collecting all Generation 1 and 2 figures, almost. I'll have to collect Generation 1 gears... And probably the rest of the Generation 2 bots I don't have, like Smokescreen. He's the only one I don't have in Grapple, so... 
and a better look at Inferno too, like the Kingdoms one. So those are the only three I still got to pick up for my Generation 2 collection. And then my collection is complete. I might get the new Beachcomber that just came out with Legacy. So that might be one I might get. And probably the Legacy Cosmos. Yeah, for sure. And maybe the Studio Series 86 Brawn. I'll just move that Brawn out of there and put the 86 version up there. But that's about it. I'll pick up for Generation 1 and 2. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.